Yeah, congratulations! You have known the most fundamental basics of how HTML works, right? Let's look at this a simple uh, wiki page. Talk about the uh, uh, HTML. Okay. Even though it's a simple, the content is simple. If you look at uh, its HTML source, it's not simple at all. So how can we get this HTML source? Okay. Of course, there are a couple of ways you can save this page. You can save it into your uh, local file system. Okay. Now I'm saving it into our local file system. You can see there will contain an HTML file and the subdirectory. Okay, and I now I'm open the HTML file. Wow, you see a lot of things too way too much before you want to learn it, you give up. <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay. So that's a real world. Okay. Uh, but I will help you a little bit. Don't panic. Even this kind of simple information uh, can be, when you study it, can be very overwhelming. Okay, you will be overwhelmed by the by the the complexity of the information, or the huge of information you need to learn all at once. Okay, you will panic. Okay, you will be stressed. Hmm. So here's the things. Okay, uh, you can right click. Okay, right click on the page or to find the view page source. Actually, you will you can see the page information from here, okay? And in Chrome, they use a, a different color to highlight the, the text. That'll be a lot easier, okay? So just focus something that you already know, okay? And notice something you haven't found it yet. For example, hmm, teacher, you don't teach me about this. What is that? Hmm, you can Google it. Okay. Or you can maybe you just type. Maybe you find nothing different. Okay. This one document type, by the way, is the HTML5. Uh, New added feature, okay, indicating the following text is HTML, okay, because sometimes the file file extension, the file extension name, uh, won't guarantee the information. So after HTML five, they define this tag. If you want want your browser, uh, no, okay, the following is HTML five syntax. Okay, please use this. Okay, and you may find this uh, class Node.js. What is that? Okay, <laughs> language English. Yeah, easy to guess. Guess right? Easy to guess. Uh, the following language will be written in English. Dir directory. Is that directory? The folder directory. And uh, something you don't know, LTR, what that is. Okay, no idea. Of course, uh, I know DIR means uh, return direction. Okay, English, uh, normally we write English from left to right. Okay, I know it because I <laughs> search for it. Okay, and that's the truth. Even teacher cannot, can have something uh, unknown to me, right? I'm also a learner. So meta, okay, as I said, the head, okay, after the heading HTML, the 
end of HTML, we will have a head and head and the body and body, right? So this kind of structure. So let's find our head. <laughs> our head is here. Okay. <laughs> okay. And you can you can search head. Okay, this part is end head. Oh very mm, a lot of line. Okay. Within the head. <laughs> okay. So meta you can assign specify your character set. So what is character set? Teacher talk about ASCII code. Uh, in that session mentioned about UT UTFA, Unicode. Hmm, but what that is <laughs> maybe sometimes we learn something and we just know uh, a little bit about it. Okay. But we want this experience to to support us. For example, you remember uh teacher said Unicode is for multiple languages. They want to represent at the same page. So you may try you may try to create a page that contains English, uh, maybe Chinese, maybe French, maybe German. <laughs> okay. Let's assume you know that you are you are you are a linguist, okay, you are polyglot. Okay, good job. And then you use a UTFA or you use the ASCII, okay, you force it a bit to, to be an ASCII to see what happens. Okay, that would be very interesting, right? Okay, so let's move on. Script. Oh, teacher talk about script is a kind of uh, JavaScript. But I have no idea what that is. Why no space, everything, they kind of, uh, cr they kind of <laughs> scratch scratch together okay this is called minimized okay they put everything very they you know, kind of remove the space and enter but you know the code is for browser as an interpreter to run sometimes this kind of technique is not easy to read but uh, better for executing so who did this okay actually the the server side of code they generate these kind of things to save the space but uh, you don't have to care so far okay the link have a ref uh, reference called a style uh, style sheet okay do you remember we talk about uh, how to beautify this no, we don't actually talk about how to do it, right? We mentioned about it, okay? So remember, uh, if you want to study the cascading style sheet, it is something that you need to know. Okay, a lot of meta, a lot of link, okay? You may be starting to wonder, uh, is this a human, human, <laughs> real people that generate this? Like me, I type every single little things. Yeah, probably you guess it is not a real person who edited it. They use a tool. They may input the content, but there's a template. The template, okay? Uh, because uh, if you look at the wiki, wiki, if you click on the wiki information, they all look the same, right? They all look the same, okay? The, the, the World Wide Web Consulting is an organization created by Sir Tim Burns Lee. Okay, this guy is amazing. He's the person who created the uh, World Wide Web, okay? But the page looks the same. They have a wiki logo, we have a search icon, they have uh, the header, headings, okay? Then have a, a different different uh, area of uh, content can switch back and forth. They all use the same style, the same font. 
Okay, so they seems to have their own style to format the content, right? If it's a the human human,、uh, they are prone to make a mistake. Okay, maybe I use at least、uh, this color. I use a, a left phone size, a different、uh, phone style. So there must be some pattern or template,、uh, and then help the 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 program to generate this page. Okay,、uh, this kind of technology we call a、uh, uh, server side. Okay, backend the program running at the server side, the backend side. They may have a database. Uh, Uh, and a server running program to help you to maintain and deliver the web content. Although we won't be cover this kind of technology because that involve a lot more uh, uh, complicated,、mm, advanced, okay, knowledge. But、uh, you know that this kind of program they will create the unified. Uniform style for the web content. Okay, that's it. Let's see some heading. Okay, after the heading, <coughs> excuse me, it's a body, right? Even body have some attribute. Oh, we learn about a, right? It's a hyperlink. Jump to content. Let's see. We can find this a. Maybe a jump to content. Can we find jump to content? No,、oh, I cannot find. <laughs> Where is the jump to content? No. Hmm 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 hmm. Quite interesting. Maybe we are not looking for. Oh. Page right. Okay. Let's see.、Uh, at the Timberley's page,、uh, here has another link, right? To link to、uh, hypertext. Okay. If I click on hypertext, this link, I will jump back to this, right? So let's view its source. Maybe let's search HTML. Wow, that's a lot of. Yeah, I think I find it right. I find it already, even though it's a a little bit difficult. Let's see. Called. HTML, a new programming language called HTML. Let's look at the source. Okay, although it's not easy to read. A language called HTML, and when we link, when we click on HTML, they will jump to. Okay, because there's a tag. There's a tag called.、Uh, HTML with the H reference. Okay. Okay. I hope that you know my intention is to. Although I'm teaching you the very basic things, but in the in reality, there's a, <laughs> a lot of complexity. I know this frustrates the beginner、uh, very often because.、Uh, Uh, enroll in the class, not necessarily have the real skill to handle in the real world, right? But trust me,、uh, you learn everybody learns step by step, okay? So be sure you have a basic understanding, and and based on your foundation, you 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 learn a little bit more, a little bit more. A little more, okay. This is how we become a、uh, uh, better a coder, 
okay, and be patient and enjoy the process, okay. I'll see you next lecture. Bye bye.